Chapter 53 The False Focus Some church people make it difficult or annoying for other Christians to go to church. On Sunday evenings, a friend goes to church alone. Her husband's back condition does not make it possible for him to attend both morning and evening worship, and he attends only in the morning. Without fail, however, someone will bustle up to ask, And why isn't your husband here tonight? In another case, one man who attends church very faithfully tries to sit toward the back in order to slip out quickly. A widower, he wants to worship the Lord. He is not interested in remarrying or in fellowship, simply in worship. All the same, many people have plans for him and they telephone him or try to waylay him to involve him in various church activities. This involves a false perspective. The purpose of Christ's church is not to fulfill human needs as we see them or to fill up the pews, however fine these goals may be. The purpose of Christ's church is His kingdom and His righteousness or justice, Matthew 6.33. And our human needs and concerns cannot take priority over this. Too many people in the church want to limit the meaning of Scripture to what it does for us. Over 30 years ago, Herman N. Ritterboss in When the Time Had Fully Come described modernism as, first, a departure from the expressed Word of God, and second, as existentialism or subjectivism, reducing the meaning of faith to what it can mean for us as individuals. Any reduction of Christianity to what it can do for the soul of man only is halfway into modernism, because the focus has shifted from God to man. What is the focus of your faith?